what you focus on each and every day, what you worry about, think about, really contributes to whether or not you have a peaceful, happy life or you have a stressful, tumultuous life. Because God wants us to focus on the right things and He's promised He's going to take care of us. Hi, there's a train going by. And you can focus on the train and the noise of the train, or you can understand it's just part of what happens in the society around us. The wind is blowing, and hopefully the effects on the microphone aren't too bad. But you can focus on the distractions if you want, or you can say, hey, it's a beautiful day and God has the sun shining. The flowers are blooming. The daisies, my mom's favorite flower. Beautiful today as the sun shines on them. You got to decide, what are you going to focus on? Are you going to worry? Or are you going to trust? Are you going to have faith in the Lord? Or are you going to walk by your own abilities and your own strength and face your own battles? I'm Craig Fritchley from the Sanctuary in Syracuse. We're so glad that you joined us today. Jesus is concerned about our focus. He told his disciples in Matthew chapter 6, he said, Wherefore, if God so clothed the grass of the field, which today is, and tomorrow is cast in the oven, shall he not much more clothe you, O ye little faith? He said, He takes care of the flowers, He takes care of the grass, He takes care of the birds, and He'll take care of you. So don't worry about what you're going to wear, or where you're going to live, or what you're going to eat. Seek God, put Him first, make Him Lord of your life, and let God provide all those things. But seek ye first the kingdom of God, verse 33 says, and His righteousness, and all these things will be added unto you. Well, are you saying, Pastor, that we're never going to have a trouble? There's never going to be a problem? We don't have to be concerned about anything? I'm not saying that at all. Because life brings trouble. Situations happen. In fact, verse 34, Jesus said, Take no thought for tomorrow, for tomorrow shall take thought for the things itself sufficient unto the day is the evil thereof. So when you get to tomorrow and things happen, God's already there. When you face situations, God knows what's happening. When you go through a trial or a test, God's right with you. He's never left you. He's always been beside you. He goes with you even through the valley of the shadow of death. So you can choose to focus on the worries, focus on the problems, focus on the inadequacies, or you can choose to focus on God. He's God Almighty. He's omnipotent. He has all power. And He can give you and will give you everything that you need. So don't worry. Don't be distracted. Every day, get up. Put your focus on Him. And let God help you as you walk this life with Him. Because my friend, when you do, everything's going to become clear. And He's going to provide what you need as you go forward. We hope you share this with others. Thank you for joining us. And we'll see you on the next Daily Devotional. God bless.